This film will show you what to expect if you are having a CT angiogram. I'm Betty and I live near Oxford. I'm having a CT angiogram um, today. Well, I'm not really frightened of the procedure, but I'm just um, hoping they're going to be able to track it, track down the problem. My name's Chiran Shudaria, uh, and I'm an honorary consultant cardiologist at the John Radcliffe Hospital in Oxford. A CT angiogram is a relatively new way and a new technique that allows us to look at the coronary arteries. Uh, the conventional way that we uh, assess a patient for coronary heart disease is with uh, a diagnostic angiogram that's more invasive uh, for the patient. A CT scan is a, is a special form of x-ray that involves radiation and it enables us to take pictures of the coronary arteries and from those pictures uh, we can work out whether or not the patient has narrowings in the coronary arteries that may be causing their symptoms and may be important to their health. This is an outpatient test when the scan itself is taking place, uh, intravenous contrast is administered through the cannula in the arm. The patient may experience uh, a hot flushing sensation. Uh, patients sometimes describe the feeling that they feel like they're wetting themselves. That's not what's happening. Uh, it's, it's a completely normal reaction to the contrast and again, it wears off very quickly. There are a couple of key steps for the CT coronary angiogram. The first thing is that the patient's heart rate needs to be well controlled uh, with a medication like a beta blocker. And the second thing is they need to hold their breath, taking the same size breath each time they receive the instruction. Breathe out. Hold your breath. The scan itself takes about 10 to 15 minutes. It's a routine, very safe and harmless procedure that we perform many times a day and from a patient perspective, uh, it's, it's a much more pleasurable experience than having a more invasive coronary angiogram. I didn't realise when the dye actually went in, um, but I did have a sensation of a hot flush, but that very quickly passed. Well, everybody explained very well what was going to happen and told me what to do, and it was absolutely fine. Nothing to worry about at all. Heart disease is still the single biggest killer in the UK. But for over 50 years, we've tirelessly pioneered research that has helped transform the lives of people living with heart and circulatory conditions. Join our fight for every heartbeat in the UK. Every pound raised, every minute of your time, and every donation to our shops will help make a difference.